I'm going to show you how to set up Black Bear Business Cloud services on your Office 365 subscription so that you can manage your Black Bear devices right through the Office 365 console and into the Black Bear uh, management console. When you log into your admin console for Office 365, as I have done here, you're going to see a couple of options on the right hand side under resources. One of them is setting up email and mobile phones. Now this option will only be shown if you have an Enterprise 1 through 4 subscription of Office 365. Unfortunately, the professional plan does not have this option currently. I go ahead and click on setting up email on mobile phones. It brings me to a page where if I scroll down, I can see set up BlackBerry Business Cloud Services with a button underneath for enable BlackBerry Business Cloud Services. I go ahead and click on that button. And it gives me an information window that lets me know that I will, once I want to manage my BlackBerry Business Cloud Services, be moved over to the BlackBerry Business Cloud Services Management Console site, and that's a, an interaction between the Office 365 portal and RIM site. So I let them know, yes, I'd like to do that. Once I've acknowledged and accepted that, under my authorized services at the bottom of the page, I'll see BlackBerry Business Cloud Services from Research in Motion. I have three options. I can do manage, support, and of course remove the service, and it's as simple as clicking a button. With support options, it'll trigger a support request, and either it will take me to uh, uh, the ability to call into Microsoft if I think it's a Microsoft issue, and call into RIM if I think it's a RIM issue. Now, if I want to actually spin up my tenant and start managing my devices, I go ahead and click on manage. This might bring me up a note letting me know that the, the tenant will take a few minutes to get going, or it should spin something up right away. You can see accessing the BlackBerry Business Cloud Services. And there we go. Welcome to BlackBerry Business Cloud Services from Microsoft Office 365. I go ahead and click Sign Up Now. I'm going to go with English in Canada. But you are able to choose the language of choice which is presented from the geography that you're logging in from. It does take geography information from your Office 365 portal setup as well. reading through the terms and conditions, using BlackBerry Business Cloud Services. I'm a fast reader. And I click on I agree. Hit continue. I'm going to show me the other agreement. It's an addendum to the BlackBerry Business Cloud, uh, BlackBerry uh, Service Level Agreement. Speed read through that. Now you'll notice at the bottom there is an option to print this so that if you do want to actually read it and make sure that it aligns with your own organization's agreements that you can go and go ahead and do that. Click on I agree, hit continue. As you can see it says creating my tenant organization. My tenant information has been saved and I go ahead and click log in. Now it's loading up the BlackBerry administrative service. setting up and completing the process. And there we go. Now I'm in the administrative console where I can actually do actions like create a user, manage the users, create a group, manage groups, create the necessary IT policies that I'm looking for, manage those policies, and obviously the functionalities on the side. That's the simple way to show you how you set up BlackBerry Business Cloud Services from the Office 365 portal. Again, there will also be videos on how to create a user and manage your users so you can get more in-depth knowledge on BlackBerry Business Cloud Services and managing those devices. Thanks for watching.